So firstly, I apologize if I have shaky hands, but this is where we're gonna start, where we walk into the apartment. I also didn't necessarily clean for this, so if it looks a little messy, eh, whatever. But when you walk in, the first thing to your left here is this huge door, and that is, of course, going to be where we have our trash. I said, of course, like that's, you know, expected. But we come over to here, and here is where we have the kitchen which honestly was like one of the major selling points of any apartment or home. Having a nice kitchen is big and I don't really cook. Like I said, I haven't really decorated all that much. My girlfriend has done most of this. I just sort of pay for it. Uh, so we could see we have our basic, you know, kitchen necessities here. My girlfriend's really fancy coffee machine, which I personally don't drink coffee, but she does. And then as you can see here, we have a Snoop Dogg cookbook I definitely haven't utilized. Coming over to the right here is the air fryer and toaster, which I'm getting ready to heat up that Culver's that I bought recently. Kitchen is very, very nice. I love the all white cabinets. Of course, everything is stainless steel. A little calendar to keep track of mine and my girlfriend's schedule for my second job really and then her job. The next thing we're going to come to is going to be my living room, which is connected right to the kitchen. Of course, where everything is sort of open floor. Now, the living room, like I said, not decorated. I'd like to put some sort of artwork up there and then maybe some stuff over there if it's not too messy. I'm not really allowed to hang things in this apartment. I'm only allowed to do like pictures, so I couldn't do like shelves over there or anything, which kind of sucks. But from here, we have a very nice, we got this on a steal. This fireplace entertainment center was 120 bucks, which is why I bought it because it was so cheap. Well, my brother bought it for me as kind of like a housewarming gift, but we saw it at Walmart. How could you not buy that? Please ignore the cables running through. I only have, I'll show you guys real quick, for internet, I only have that single port and then have to use like an ethernet adapter to get more. And that's why there's cables running into this room. And you'll also see cables running right over there. But the living room, huge couch, absolute love it. My parents got it as like our housewarming gift, which was very nice of them. Girlfriend's a little Pikachu kind of chilling off to the side here. Couch, we, I think we got from like Ashley's Furniture. Extremely nice, very comfy. I've actually slept out here a few times just cause it was just comfortable. I didn't feel like moving. Nice little coffee table here. And then we also have a little rug to go there as well. Very happy with it so far. Like I said, I would like to do artwork or something here just to add some sort of life to the room. But for right now, it works. Coming to the back here is where we have our sunroom. So this is about an extra six feet of space where I currently use it as two of my work setups. So I have technically two jobs. Here is my main one where I am an Epic analyst for a healthcare system. So I help build the uh, kind of hospital system that we use. So we got a nice little desk here, double monitor set up with a little work computer. This chair, okay, so really quick. These chairs were like $700 each. I have two of them, because I needed one for here and then one for like the actual game room. So $700 each, extremely comfortable. But if you take a look here, you see the, see the curve? Those little curves there, if you don't sit completely normal, like, you know, just legs normally positioned, not as comfortable, which I sit like a gremlin, so worth the money if you sit normally, but like, eh, for me. But over here is work setup number two. Now I do have a work laptop that would usually sit here and a keyboard and a mouse, uh, but it's currently in my other room just because I sort of play games while doing this job because it's not that busy. Uh, but we do have work set up here, number two. This is the same desk that I have over here, just in a different color. So we can see white desk there, black desk behind us. Uh, no cable management, I will give you a warning, there's no cable management at all in this apartment right now. As a kind of final view of the living room and the kitchen, this is what it does look like. So, so the first room we're gonna come into here is going to be the bedroom. Again, not very much decorated, but we come on into here. And here is going to be the master bedroom, which literally, that is all for the time being. Like there's, <laughs> there's a bed, there's two dressers, uh, and that's it. So everything else is really bland at the moment. I have all my medicine that sits in a corner that hasn't moved since I moved in a month ago. I will eventually find a place for that to go. Pretty big size. That's a queen bed and there's still tons of room on this side and tons of room on this side. So like there's more than enough space here. I could put a TV and like a dresser here and eventually. I don't know. That costs more money. Coming over here is going to be the bathroom. Now I'm just going to give a quick little view of this. We have the nice double sinks here. Very nice big shower here for the master bathroom. Honestly, really like it. It's kind of cozy. I never had this nice of a shower in my life, so that's pretty cool. This is, of course, just like a towel closet and everything. Nothing too special. Here we have a closet, which is also very big. Uh, <laughs> much bigger than a closet I've ever owned in my entire life. Uh, so tons of room in here. This is all just my clothes for the time being. My girlfriend doesn't have any or much stuff in here. And then like a quick little look over here. I don't know. I have no idea what that is. I didn't ask and I, I also don't really want to know. Uh, but huge closet space here. We can fit a ton. Uh, and this is just one closet. We have another one. So let's go ahead and take you guys to where the gaming setup is. I will give one final warning here. This is not cable managed. 
I am sorry. So here is, God, it's, it's so just bland right there. Uh, but here's the current gaming setup. Again, currently not cable managed at all. Like I said, there's one of my work laptops just sitting there. Please ignore it. And we do have some extra stuff here. This literally is cable management stuff and I just haven't used it. Uh, so whatever, I'll get around to it eventually. Uh, but currently, this is where the setup lives. I know the monitors are kind of like weirdly placed. That's because the screens are big. It's hard to get three of them to look good. Shut up, it works. It has, that's all that matters. Uh, so we have one of our Elgato key lights back there, another Elgato light there. Our camera is positioned right above that monitor, which is nice to have. And then our microphone's kind of weirdly set up, but it works. I uh, usually just run it right underneath that monitor and all is good to go. Now the computer setup itself hasn't changed much since I last made a video on like a tour. Uh, it's 3080, 5950X, 32 gigabytes of RAM, nothing too crazy, but this is currently the gaming station. The very generic kind of Ikea setup here, which my desk is very much not angled correctly. Hold up. Now you see I do have those like Govi LED strips there, but I also do have Philips Hue lights back here. And then I have this little like night sky thing down here, which I'm not gonna turn on right now, but it looks kind of cool. Eventually when I decorate and have like shelves or anything back here, it'll look a lot nicer. Coming into here, we're gonna flip this light on here, which gives us bathroom number two. We come in here, here's our one single vanity, so we don't have a double vanity in here as the secondary bathroom. And then we do have a secondary shower here. And like I said, this also does come with a second walk-in closet. This one I can actually give you a slightly better view of to see kind of the size of it. Uh, very big closet. Again, there's literally nothing in here other than boxes from my work stuff.